What you're doing is something that the National Guard is very good at, but Alaska obviously is a bit of a ways away from Louisiana. They need your help. This is something that has been a severe impact for the state. Obviously the flooding, lack of electricity, there's a lot of pain down there and what the Guard does, what the military does, what the Army does is you get there and you help. I don't know if this is going to be 14 days, 21 days, it could be extended. They need your help. You volunteered and again I cannot say anything but thank you for what you're doing. We are ready. You guys are resilient and you showing up, that's good for us, it's good for Alaska, but of course it's good for the people of Louisiana and that's really what we're here to do. So I am curious, how many this is your first time to volunteer for domestic operations, for a fire or a flood or anything like that. Just about everybody. That is incredible. One thing I do, again, love about the military, you raise your right hand, you say this will defend. And yes, of course, that means the United States of America. Of course, that means Alaska because you're guardsmen. But in this case, what you're helping to defend from a natural disaster is our fellow citizens in Louisiana. So good on you. And I very much look forward to welcoming you back when you get here, don't languish. If you need anything, you call and we'll make sure you get it. Sound good? All right. Thank you again, guys. I appreciate it. Great job. Very proud of you. All right. Safe travels.